and this is Kirby Electric Fossil Studio in Milford, Delaware. I want you to get back to your roots. So the roots are, I guess in simplest forms, if you were to take 12 songs, if I were to tell you right now, what 12 songs would be like the dream playlist of cover songs um, that you would love playing? Not to make anybody else happy, but you. This would make solely you happy. So imagine an audience of a thousand yous out there. So you're not playing for to get the audience reaction. These are the songs that you think are just the best. It's 12 songs. And they could be varying styles. They don't have to be cohesive at all. At all. It could be as wild as Metallica's Disposable Heroes and... Taylor Swift's love song. They could be all on the same playlist. Everything for the widest range you could possibly imagine. Old, new, whatever it may be. But what would be the top 12 songs that you would put in that playlist? Now, once you've done that, note that that is your musical DNA. Those are your roots. Those 12 songs, not entirely but in essence those are your roots those are your that's your musical foundation your musical dna play along to that every now and again go back to that every now and again as a touchstone to remind yourself that this is why you play keyword play not work at music but play music that's why you love it, why it, it inspires you, why it's a release for you, why you spend so much time thinking about it, why it's, it's just constantly in your brain. Go back to that, appreciate those things, and then, find, then think about where you are today. How far away are you from your musical DNA? Because here's the big picture, and I've said it before. When someone is watching you perform, they're watching another human being express their experience on life on this rock floating through space. And they're going, do I relate to what they're saying, what they're feeling, what they're going through? So if you are authentically tapping into your musical DNA, there's a better odds of them actually having that connection with you. If you're trying to be something you're not or trying to, you know, play to someone else's interest. So if you're just trying to solely play to the audience, look, I, I can play Neil Diamond. It would be weird. I wouldn't love it. Now, there's some people out there that would love playing Neil Diamond. That's their favorite thing in the world. And it would show and people would love it. But not me playing it. Because they knew I wouldn't, I wasn't loving it. You get what I mean? So go back to your musical DNA. Recalibrate yourself. Get back to your roots. Inspire yourself once again. And go in that direction. Because if you follow your musical DNA, you're following your passion. That will come out in your music, in your performance, because you're passionate about it. You're, you're truly in love with it. And it'll show. And you have more fun because you're doing stuff you love. And you love doing. Look, not to be morbid, you know, life is not guaranteed. Every day is not guaranteed. Tomorrow is not guaranteed. So enjoy yourself. Enjoy playing music. Don't do it because of any other reason than you love it. You love to see people have a good time. So it's hard to do. It's not an easy task, but get back to your roots. Find that passion within yourself. If you like to book some time, feel free to reach out to me through Instagram, Facebook, or you can email me at electricfossil at yahoo.com. 
You can also uh, reach out to me if you want to come by and take a tour of the studio. This is the live room um, here. I've, I've got a couple of pianos. I've got plenty of electric guitars, plenty of amplifiers, Roland amps, Marshall amps, Fender amps, Vox amps, Orange amps, the whole thing. Uh, Pearl drum set back here, so you don't really need much as far as equipment uh, is concerned. But if you'd like to reach out to me to take a look at all this stuff or book some time, feel free to reach out to me through Instagram, Facebook, or email. I'm Kirby. This is Electric Fossil Studio. See you soon.